Hello Earth Signs, welcome to my channel Cancer Moon Oracles. My name is Rosa and I'm here to bring you a weekly love read. We are going to find out about how this person truly feels towards you at this current time. So if you are a Taurus, a Virgo, a Capricorn, this reading is for you. Do keep in mind guys, this reading is for entertainment purposes only, so the messages coming through may or may not resonate for you. That is totally okay, but if they do, feel free to let me know by hitting that like button or subscribing where you will be supporting the channel. And of course, we'll be notified of every time I release a new video here on the channel. So let's dive straight on in guys. Let's find out about how this person truly feel, feels towards you and this connection at this current time. Okay, this one wanted to come through. The sun, interesting. Okay, so this person feels happy about this connection. They feel very positive um, about you and this connection. Okay, this person feels like they want to shower you with a lot of attention as well. You could be dealing with a Leo. Don't have to be, but for some of you, this could be a Leo. Oh, beautiful. Okay, we've got the Daughter of Cups. Could be Water Energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. This person has positive feelings about you and this connection. I feel like this person wants to come towards you and open up about their feelings they're not ready to have deeper meaningfuls i still feel like this is fresh because the daughter of cups is the page of cups so it's a very um young energy okay it, it might still feel like this is early days in this connection this person could be younger than you this person may have children right this person may want children. This person may feel like they are ready for children or they want children here. But there's something about this person's feelings, like they're bursting with all of these beautiful colours. Like it feels so colourful here. So I'm getting happy, positive, joyful vibes coming from this person about how they feel towards you. They want to communicate with you. They want to talk to you. They want to send you a message. This person feels drawn to talk to you, maybe on the daily. Um, don't be surprised if this person sends you a message in the morning to say good morning. Um, this person may send you a message at night, sort of close out the day and ask you how your day was and, you know, sweet dreams. It's like I see this coming from this person. But this person is developing feelings here. We've got the Daughter of Wands now. Strong fire energy for some of you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. This person feels inspired by you or this connection. I see the Daughter of Wands as an energy of someone who feels inspired to take action here, take action on their feelings. They feel inspired to develop this relationship. I see the infinity symbol here. So they are feeling a connection with you, Taurus. And at, at this point, this connection feels positive. They feel positive that this connection can develop into something more. So right now with the Daughter of Wands, in this person's mind, because they have good, because their feelings towards you is positive, right? Their mind is like lit up with 
visions of what it would look like in this connection if you were to take it seriously, if they were to take it seriously or if they were to invest a commit. Like their mind is lit up with different scenarios of what's possible. Because that's how I'm seeing it in my mind's eye, right? Um, too many cards. If you don't have children and you're ready to have children or you want to have children, this person this person definitely sees themselves as having children with you. Uh, look at this. I'm not surprised that the three of wands came out, guys. I am not surprised whatsoever. This was what was in my mind. This person is having strong visions of your future together, of what it would look like to have you in their life long term. They are starting to visualize um, this relationship uh, and what it would look like, you know, in six months time, in 12 months time. They're starting to see a future here with you. They're starting to make plans um, in, their, in their mind. Because why? Because they're excited by this connection. They feel very positive uh, about this connection. So the, the fires are lit within this person's heart. Let's get some more cards. We're using two decks here today, guys. Oh, right. Here we go. Queen of Emotions could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. But the Queen of Emotions is an energy of someone who has very strong feelings here. So I feel like this person's feelings are growing stronger and stronger. There's strong maternal or paternal energy here coming from this person. Look, this person may be a parent already, but maybe the motivator for this person is they can really see themselves um, having a family here with you. There's something very nurturing and caring and loving coming through with the Queen of Emotions. This person really does, is starting to develop care, like caring feelings or strong, loving feelings, but their emotions are definitely growing stronger. Wow, the star card. Yeah, this person reveres you. This person respects you. This person is lit by your energy. The star is, we, we look up to the, the sky and we see the star as something very, very special. So this person feels that you are very special. You are very unique. And they want to develop things here with you. They want to see where this can go. Again, um, don't be surprised if this person showers you with a lot of attention, okay? They feel like they want to make you feel very special. We've got the three of inspiration, which again, um, that's the three of wands. I feel like see, I'm seeing dominoes, like, you know, that domino effect. Once the ball starts rolling here, I feel like, Things are going to develop very, very quickly in this connection. This person just, the, the stars are aligning. The energies are aligning here. Okay, not just for them, but for you too. Like, this person definitely wants to move things forward now. They want growth. They want progress. Uh, look at this. What a beautiful reading, guys. Honestly, what a beautiful, beautiful reading. Uh, let me just show you this card. It's the Nine of Emotions, which is the, the, the card of wishes and dreams. So this person uh, sees you as their wish, fulfillment. They see you as um, 
the be all and end all because <laughs> we've got the star card here as well so we've got two cards in this spread earth signs that is strongly indicating that this person has strong feelings towards you they desire you and they definitely want to see where this connection can take them i that's a bit better it's all in the frame now um but i feel like this person feels like they're on cloud nine you make this person very very happy they feel very very joyful to be around you i just feel like this person's emotions are just bursting okay um they're very elated they 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 feel like they're floating it almost feels like that this person's feet are not touching the ground. That's how overcome they are with how they feel towards you. So there we have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Um, don't forget to let me know by hitting that like button. And until next time, guys, take care.